You know what I'm saying? You say you, I, I got I to gotta touch on it. You know, I wanted you to finish, but I, I had to ask, like, did you, you say you played professional. Yeah. You played professional ball. Yeah, in the Dominican Republic. Yeah. Man, how, you know what? It seems like a lot of players do that, man. Yeah, bro. They just say, fuck it. Like, I'm mm -hmm. going overseas, bro. Like, I'm going to go play ball overseas. And it'd be some dope players, yeah, you know? But maybe, what, what do you feel? Do you feel like motherfuckers do that because they can get better shine over there, better, you know, incentives, mm -hmm. you know, from the situation than they would playing over here in an American league? I think it's more so the experience. Hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because, hmm. like, the way the NBA makes it seem is, like, almost impossible to make it. Yeah, they do, You know bro. what I'm saying, bro? Yeah, they do, bro. But now you start hearing about these teams in, in, in different countries, and you're like, nah, nah, hold on, hold on. This, this guy went overseas. I right, bet. I could go overseas. Like, right. You know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> it's like, out there, bro, literally, you could get your shine on wherever. Like, and they show a lot of love, a lot of genuine love. Hmm. You know, these are people that... You know, don't have the access that we do out here in the states. Yeah, we take it for granted. And we over take here. it for granted sometimes. For granted. You feel me? So it's like out there, it's like, yo, nah, this is a, we we like him, and it's not even about your name. We'll boo superstars right. here, like, and we over there, they over there praising people right. who ain't even on a LeBron type of you status or somebody of that nature. <laughs> I feel it. And then they come back to the states, and then they regular, you know. Yeah. But then you tell everybody about the stories, yo, yo, overseas, I'm the king. Like, that's I'm why gonna, motherfuckers leave and don't come back. You feel me? Like that's why they leave and don't come back. It all makes sense I'm now. To tell you, it's bro. like why not go get where you can get your love? Your you love, know what I'm saying? Exactly. And I'm telling you, I, I say it all the time, bro. If you feel good, you gonna play good, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? If you look good, you gonna perform good, bro. Yeah. That's why you see a bunch of superstars pulling up in their fly fits. You know, you know, probably just got a massage the day before. Or, yeah. You know, a lot of fan love, and it's like, nah, nah, nah. I'm, I got to do my job. Yeah. You know, you don't got to worry about all the other things, you know? So. Yeah. Because we definitely, I think uh, us as NBA fans over here, we definitely, like, hold a motherfucker accountable. Right. Like, so right. they can have a bad day. You better not come up in here playing bad because right. we about to make it worse. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, <laughs> it's bro? Crazy, bro? Straight up, some of the fans are crazy in some cities. How long did you, uh, how long did you play pro over there? I played pro just for six months, bro. Yeah. And the pandemic hit and it was like, they had to send us back home. And it's funny because Damn. I had gotten drafted to the LMB, which is the League National Basketball. It's kind of like the NBA in the Dominican Republic. Mm -hmm. Like if you make it to that league, you're stamped. Mm -hmm. So I had gotten drafted and I had to turn it down because I wanted to do this movie. Damn. It's like Netflix versus the, the pro pro bowl. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And uh, I'm like, I, I got to go with Netflix. I why couldn't they? Why couldn't you have that worked out for you? Did the times not... It, it was yeah. The times didn't align. You know what I'm saying, and it's just yeah. like, oh, okay, we'll find somebody else. It's that fast, right? Because they ain't gonna fuck around and, and, and wait yeah, for yeah, you. You know what I'm saying? It's like, all right, cool. We we have another player that wants it. You know, so I'm just like, you know what? I'll let somebody else get that. You know, it's something I've been working for my entire life. But then this other opportunity comes knocking at my door, and it's Netflix, and I'm just right. like. Nah, nah, hold on. I got, I got to, I got to reevaluate certain things. This, this might be my calling, bro. You know. Yeah, you were, bro. You for the time you was in the movie, it was, it was outstanding, bro. It brought a lot of energy in your sure. scene. It had a lot going on, so that's why I, I feel you on that. But I'm like, damn, bro. Just to, that's that's something you've been working on all your life too, mm -hmm. bro. Like you've mm -hmm. been waiting to get out of that yeah, shit. Man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's like, yeah, to weigh the options, movies or basketball. Which one do you feel like you could find? I mean, you could find a longevity in them both. Yeah, that's what you know? I'm saying. And less, and I mean, shit for Netflix is less harm on your body. <laughs> shit, you go out, do some shit. Like a nigga don't gotta do a whole bunch of extra everything, right, you know. So right. I do get that, homie, for real. You know what I'm saying? And then yeah. the minute I moved out here, I'm just like, bro, I could, I could do, do it all. You could act, you could hoop. You know what I'm saying? And it's not putting no restriction to yourself. In my name, the movie. And my name in the movie, my name is like Mr. Everything. Yeah. And I try to like, I took that, I'm like, damn, okay, Mr. Everything. And not to look at it from like no cocky way, but like I feel like I could do it all, you know what I'm saying? Except, I mean, I could dance a little bit, but I could hoop, I could make music, I could act, like it's, it's no limit to what you could do. Do you, you feel know? like you started to find this out about yourself more when that pandemic hit because you got to sit 100%, down? 100%. Like you yeah. said earlier, timing. Yeah. That's that, you know what I'm saying? That's the... 
hit it. Timing is everything, bro. bro. You just hit it. You know what it is? Everything just hits at the right time. And you know what? I feel you on that, bro. Mm -hmm. I ain't going to harp on you to say like, damn, because I'm looking at it. I'm like, me personally, I probably would have took the basketball contract. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? That's mm -hmm. just me personally. But then when I start to look at it, it's like, a motherfucker can be great at anything they set themselves right. to. So sometimes right. you you gotta gamble. Right. You can't right. sometimes you can't do everything. Sometimes you gotta really gamble, man. You know what I'm saying? Be like, all right, well, fuck it. I'm gonna go over, I'm gonna go here. You know, even though I probably got less experience in that department. Right. Because you don't seem like you've been acting all your life. Nah. You was playing basketball right. all your life. Do you think now see in the movie Hustle? You did a basket. That was a basketball scene. Absolutely. Do you feel like you can do things outside of that, 100%. other than just playing basketball in somebody's film? Oh, one hundred percent. I could do. I feel like I could be in a dr dramatic movie, like a drama movie. I'm, yeah. I'm very dramatic sometimes. I'm not gonna lie, bro. Yeah. Like, it's. I, f I found this out when I was working with my. You should uh, keep it a band, bro. I'm not mad. Nah, at you, bro. you sometimes I got You got to yeah. be dramatic, bro. Cause yeah. like. You might not get it your way. Now, now I see how a bunch of females, they get it their way. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. like, oh my God, I can't do this. Well, I can't do that. And then it's like, you know, all right, fine. Here, here you go. Like, no worries. But I feel like I could tap into like drama. Uh, pretty much anything they put in front of me, I feel like I could do, bro. You yeah. know what I'm saying? You don't know unless you try. Yeah. So, yeah, man, I feel like I, I definitely see myself more in, like in the drama side of things. Oh, that's serious. Well, I like serious roles, bro. Yo, we just hit 400,000 subscribers right here on the Clips channel. So if you want to help us out, click subscribe, get us to 500K. Yeah.